Chris, away to Stafford, three points, three big points, and also three deserving points as well. What were your thoughts on the game? Yeah, I thought it was absolutely tremendous. You know, we backed up what we did last week and not get a result. That's what was after a similar level of performance, but obviously we needed to be more ruthless. Uh, really enjoyed the first goal. I thought the link-up play for that was tremendous. And, uh, you know, that allowed us to um, you know, give us a good platform to gain more confidence in the game, away from home, especially against a good side that have been doing well recently. And then second half, I thought we uh, nullified their qualities, frustrated them, and uh, got on and got a deserved third. Would have had, would have, you know, uh, if I'm being picky, I thought there was good opportunities in the transition to go on and score more when we um, just made the wrong choice. But overall, 3.30, clean sheet. Um, yeah, delighted, man. delighted. It's a tough side as well. Stafford also looked there as well and, and had, had some good results recently, and we've, we've come in. And, <laughs> it's got three. Yeah, no, uh, <clears throat> you know, it's. Um, well, if you look at how many chances we've created today, I think we created six and scored three. Um, so that's really pleasing. Half and half, good high percentage of that. Last week, the amount of chances we created and didn't, didn't score um, <clears throat> in general play was frustrating. The uh, amount of attempts on goal. But we've worked hard again this week on, on numerous things. You can see um, the confidence is growing since Marsk, even though there's a couple of results in there that haven't gone for us. You know, um, the quality of what we're looking for, certainly in possession, uh, it was good. Obviously losing Scott yesterday and then obviously making the change at the back, I thought Cow came in and was a man alongside Darius. Tom was his steady self again, 8 out of 10. And uh, young Matty's had a you know, tremendous long deal with us, which uh, we're really pleased. I think we're going to be extending that, so that'll be pleased for everybody. We'll confirm that uh, shortly. But um, you know, the young man's been a breath of fresh air, as as uh, Dylan and uh, Scott have, and they've enabled us to give us the confidence. Um, you know, with three young men coming in who were not wounded regarding previous results, and um, got a really fresh confidence to the changing room, which has enabled us to to build off the back of that. So. Yeah, but I thought the lads were outstanding today. I was a bit concerned in the warm-up, I'll be honest with you. I said to them, ride to kick off, don't like what I've seen. And um, hopefully we don't start the game like that. And they didn't, you know, and, uh, yeah, I was really pleased, enjoyed. You know, we've got good bodies in the right areas for the first goal and Dags has done what you know, we're looking for him to do. Uh, bring that experience, that composure, that calmness in and around the 18-yard box. When, when we link things up with them and uh, yeah, delighted with the performance. So Nathan on the score sheet, uh, again, he got, got one a couple of weeks ago as well. He's come in and added a, gave us a bit more threat and also gets us one club as well. Yeah, well, he's scored in one and two now, which is, you know, not a bad ratio. He should have scored last week, he knows that. Um, he's had another great chance in the game where we've got him through. Um, where again, we've got to work on his, uh, his finishing. But he's a young man learning his trade. You know, we've given the opportunity, it was his previous club he was at, I'm sure he wanted to do, you know, um, show Stafford yeah, what they're missing. And um, I thought his work rate was outstanding, first and foremost. Showed some really good quality, some intelligent um, runs into good areas that, you know, really hurt the opposition. And uh, yeah, it was, uh, I was really pleased for him as well to get on the score sheet. So you mentioned the defence. I think we stood strong today against you know, a load of set pieces, a load of long throws, big strike up front, and, and we've, we've, we've dealt with them. Yeah, I was concerned at half time regarding the amount of set pieces we conceded. I said to them, look, we've got to limit that if we can second half. Um, or else we're going to put ourselves under serious pressure. But we talked about it, we worked on that on Thursday in particular about uh, the long throw. And uh, the lads have delivered today, and that's why you can ask as a coach or a manager. The lads haven't let you know, the disappointment of last Saturday, they didn't. You could know, say we disappointed them and let that get to you, but they've come out and, and backed up last Saturday's performance with, with another performance, and obviously it's a the rewards. <coughs> yeah, but we've got, to, you know, we've achieved nothing at the moment. You know, it's a great weekend for us. We've got to enjoy it. We've not had too many recently, and then it's back in Tuesday and hard work. It's as simple as that. Two good sessions, and then we're up against another tricky side, difficult side to beat next week. And Coles, who uh, again um, having a good season. They've done well against all the top teams, and uh, it'll be a difficult game next week. And a nice moment at the end there with the, with the fans, everyone, everyone getting involved in, it, in a in a nice celebration. It's it's important that we show our appreciation individually. 
and shake everybody's hand that's come and supported the lads today. You know, they kept singing right throughout the game, even though they were outnumbered one to ten, I would say. You know, I'm not too sure what the crowd was today, but um, there was good numbers here um, for them. But they kept singing away, and um, we've given, we've sent them home happy. Um, we've sent everybody home happy this weekend, and uh, yeah, I'm really pleased for everybody at the football club. Fans, volunteers, players, you know, staff. Um, yeah, it's been a long week even though our performance was excellent last week. But this week we backed it up by being more clinical.